Hi girls, it's Thursday. I'm really sorry if you hear whining. The dogs are outside and have decided that they can't be bothered to play. They need to sit at the door and whine. And I'm sorry I was gone last week, but I'm here now. Um, last week's topic was cyberbullying. I don't have a lot to add. The other girls kind of said what I would say. Um, I've been harassed on YouTube. I've had very, very mean, hurtful comments about my weight. I have reported every single one of them to YouTube, so that's what I would advise. Stand up for yourself. Um, I've experienced more bullying in real life than I have on the internet, so. Um, and then my topic this week was about like healthcare professionals and if you've experienced any negative things in uh, going to see the doctor um, regarding your weight. And I, I asked this because I recently had this experience. Um, as a woman, I have an examination annually, um, and I went in to have this particular exam, and on my registration form it asked if I would like to discuss my weight. And I checked no, because I didn't want to. It's not what I was there for. I don't need to discuss my weight with a nurse practitioner. Sorry. And, um, so I went back and this nurse practitioner was incredibly rude to me and I feel like should never be treating patients because she was awful. Um, she was really rude. And then we began the exam and as you girls know, when you have one of these exams, you're primarily not wearing any clothing. And in the middle of my exam, I'm literally naked on a table, she asks, so have you always been this heavy? A, it's not your business, is it? B, I checked no on the damn form, so I absolutely did not want to discuss this with you. C, what in your brain makes you think that when I am lying naked on a table, is the appropriate time to ask me that question. Sorry, the dogs are jumping on the door. What? It was so inappropriate. And the thing is, that when you're asked that kind of thing, some people can stand up for themselves, but I bet that I'm in the majority here and that I was so ashamed that I had to backpedal and talk about, um, you know, my weight loss journey and how I was trying to lose weight and all of this stuff. And you know what? That's ridiculous. I shouldn't have to say that. I should have just said, yes. You took my blood pressure. It's perfect. I'm fine. When I have health issues regarding my weight that I'd like to discuss with you, I will come and discuss them with you. I was very angry. It was the worst. I just feel like it's absolutely unacceptable for healthcare professionals to speak to people like that. There is no reason to do it. So I just wanted to know what everyone else's experience was. If this was something that's widespread, is if is this do you avoid the doctor because of it? Um, I know that I have to have this exam, so I won't avoid the doctor, but, you know, it just makes me wonder what we do to make it unacceptable to be asking those questions. So, in any case, um, yeah, I'm going to go. I, uh, I've got a little bit to do and then going to work and um, tomorrow I'm going on a little road trip so that'll be fun. Maybe Jenny and I will vlog a little but um, we're taking a little trip to Spokane. We're going to go shopping because we don't have a Torrid or a Lane Bryant in Missoula so we're going to go and um, yeah I'll see you next week. Love you.